Okay guys, this is probably video uh, 5 up to this point, video 5 or 6, um, showing you guys uh, uh, before I uh, bond this uh, crack area on my side, uh, my 98 Eclipse uh, side body kit here. Um, notice the last video I just uh, installed Gorilla double side tape uh, glue. Um, double side tape on the back of this uh, body kit and it's, it's been taped in and pushed in uh, just um, if it's kind of losing just uh, have like um, a board or something to, to push it down uh, for overnight and uh, it should um, the glue should be adhesive uh, will be stick onto the body if you don't do it you know if your crack is big and it might not uh, uh, the tape might not be um, attached onto the body um, so you're gonna need something you're really gonna need something to push it down in that case but uh, like my body kit it it just moved out a little bit so I just just a little bit gaps that I can see so my tape wasn't on right I just use like a uh, like this big um, wood board right there to uh, have it lay down against it and uh, overnight and the tape is uh, now attach it so um, I uh, after that I use uh, 80 grit sandpaper either 80 grit or 100 grit sandpaper to kind of sand um, this area before I do any bonding so as you can see uh, I've been sanding it uh, let me get a closer shot so you guys can see it um, there it is. It's been sanded. So all you do is just get an 80 grit or 100 grit sandpaper and kind of sand this area good uh, because uh, uh, you need to sand it before you put any bonding. And uh, if you don't sand it, you know, the bond, the body filler might not uh, uh, work. It might not attach to this, uh, this area that, you, that I'm trying to... Uh, uh, trying to put body fill on so just kind of sand around this corner too you might you, you might gonna put some well I might gonna have to put some body fill around this area too even though I have a boat here and everything but from down here I'm gonna use uh, I'm probably gonna use um, silicone uh, that I got from low you know the, the clear kind of silicone and uh, just to seal up the water so water don't you know won't comes in but uh you can use like uh, I think uh, polyurethane uh, glue that you can buy from out there. Uh, that kind of glue will seal up this crack right here. Um, I haven't buy it. I, I didn't have that, so I, I'm probably not gonna use that glue uh, for this purpose. Um, I already have uh, double side gorilla tape inside here, so I'm gonna try to use the bondo, the body filler, to kind of uh, fill this up. And uh, practicing it uh, while you know I'm here, because um, I just got a new uh, bondo uh, bottle, and uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna use it, you know, since I got it, um, since I just bought it. So all you gotta do is just uh, before you bonding, just sand it. You sand with a uh, 80 or 100 grit sandpaper. Sand it good. Don't sand it all the way down to the metal, to the bare metal. Just enough to have the roughness and uh, the gray showing, you know. Uh, but uh, you do want to uh, use the sander like I did in the other video to sand out these uh, this old bondo right here, okay? Sand out, sand it out first, and then use the sandpaper to, uh, after you attach the body kit on. And then uh, simply next is that you want to clean this area. See all the dust that you that I just sand. I'm gonna use my air compressor right here with the air blow gun and just uh, turn my uh, air compressor on it's been fully charged turn it on high and uh, just get my air blow gun here and blow out all the dirt see that and make sure you want to have the door closed while you do any air gun spray blowing it <laughs> So dirt won't come in the car. So just make sure that 
Make sure you get all the corners, all the cracks. The dirt from the cracks down there. Make sure you blow, you know, blow all those uh, dirt from the crack. So, next, I can just simply use uh, one of this um, water pads or a towel with water. And, uh, or you can leave it dry. I mean, after the, after blowing out the dirt, you can use a, uh, this, you know, anything with water to wipe it down. Wipe it good. Don't use too much water, just enough uh, damp, you know, just enough to uh, clean out all the dirts around it. Um, and let it dry. If you, if you, you know, you're trying to dry too quickly, Get a get a heat gun and dry it, and uh, I would leave it in the sun for like a few minutes, 10, 5, 10 minutes to have it dry before I put a uh, uh, bondo body filler on. Okay, so I'm ready to do that next. See you in my next video. Bye guys.